What is up everybody? It's your boy Berto and today I thought about making another video over the Allen Bradley Micro A50 more specifically the 2080 LC50 24 QWB That's a long, uh, that's a long word to say and in this video we're going to talk about what to expect on startup and how to hardwire that type of controller because looking through YouTube I found out that there's really not a whole lot of beneficial information. And so without further ado, hope you guys enjoy this video and it's beneficial for you. And of course, here are the components that I will be talking about today. All right. So, of course, you're going to provide your power supply, convert it from AC to DC, and then to hook it up, you're going to go to your output terminal side, and there you have 24 volts DC positive and 24 volts DC negative because of polarity. And on the other side of my uh, on station 4 panel, I already have it done, but what I wanted to show you all is what happens when you apply power to it without the bus terminator module. Okay, so we're going to apply power and it's starting up. But then notice this. Okay. As you can see, red indicators blinking on the fault and the MS. Now what that means is that it's not being able to recognize your modules, your expansion modules and your embedded modules up here. Now don't be alarmed because you do not have the bus terminator module that is hooked up to your modules up here. Okay, so this is one that's functioning right now. And of course I'm bringing in power to my inputs and my output side. And as you can see, there's no more fault. Now what you are able to do is that once you go to your software to configure and to communicate with this PLC, it's going to read the fault and tell you that it's not able to recognize your modules this and this up here. What you're going to do next is however which way you're communicating, which for me is in, through the internet, I am going to connect to it and configure it, of course, and there you go. And then when you connect to it, it's going to tell you about the fault. But when you're going to download a program, go ahead and download something simple. And then it's going to say once you download to the controller, it's going to clear the fault. The fault. And so you go ahead and clear the fault. And you should be able to program perfectly fine until you get the bus terminator. So of course this was more of an introduction to the controller type that we're using for the Allen Bradley. And of course my next videos I'm going to show you all how to use it, how to hardwire it more specifically, and also how to use the software which is Components Workbench. I do want to apologize for not being able to post more videos as I was supposed to which was my goal in the first place but hopefully with more flexibility time that I have now I should be able to post more so I want to thank you guys so much for supporting me please subscribe share comment and see y'all next time